So what is the Archon Haze Challenge? If you aren't an FDEF, or if you are and you leave voice comms after setcon early, chances are you may be unfamiliar with this term. It's pretty self-explanatory, but the parameters of completing the challenge are where things start to get interesting, so let's get into it. To complete the Archon Haze Challenge, you need to start a custom battle for Crimson Haze, having in slot a rank 17 ship of your choice and an Archon. The objective is to complete all three stages without dying, all by yourself, using just your Archon. You will need three players to launch, so it's a rule that your teammates must either disconnect or take singularities and stay permanently cloaked. You must be the leader of the custom battle if they choose the second option. Being in a custom battle runs the match by the old tier system except with every rank grouped into one mega tier. Additionally, and most importantly, you will not have any power or defense levels to boost your ship, making this challenge an equally difficult playing field for all competitors. How does this play out? In round 1, your objective is to destroy three outposts in order. The only thing you're going to have trouble with here is making your way across the battlefield to get in range of the next station. After all, the Archon is a pretty slow ship. Once you get there, the stations are relatively easy to take out with sustained primary fire. In round 2, you will enter the complex, destroying turrets and capturing beacons. This is very easy as well, but the turrets do deal EM damage, which could significantly hurt your shield if not taken into account in some way. The major trouble and one choke point of the whole operation occurs when the player gets to the other side of the base. The next objective is to catch the remaining two beacons of round 2. With plentiful enemies of all three standard classes and a huge hitbox for your ship, staying out of the line of fire of enemies long enough to capture a beacon can pose a serious issue. In round 3, your ship and skill will be tested. Multitasking killing enemies that will otherwise kill you, micromanaging your position on the battlefield, and killing the transports before they reach the outpost is a rigorous test of both ship building skill and piloting skill. Should you manage to beat the challenge, you can brag to your friends, upload the video to YouTube, or dunk on people in chat because they bad. Video coming on December 21st on how to defeat this challenge with relative ease.